What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another Ding TV video. In today's video, I'm going to be going over a couple comments that were posted on recent videos of mine. First off, I want to shout out Da Pit for letting me know about this background app and process list. So Depit commented on one of my videos and said, easier way is to go and search and type in background apps and process list to close apps in the background. And I also use this to clear cache. So all you have to do to get this application is go up to your search bar and type in background apps and process list or say background apps. You'll see the application. I already have it, so it's gonna open it up for me. You would just download it. So here you can close all apps from this top menu. You can refresh, you can scroll up and down. So this app actually doesn't close the applications for you. It just sends you to the place to force stop and clear the cache. So it eliminates a few steps. It does make it a lot easier. If I do hit close all apps, what's gonna happen is it's gonna take me to each open app. So I hit force stop, I'm gonna clear the cache and then hit back and it'll take me to the next app, go back. And now we're good. We don't have any applications running and it lets us know that. So we're running at tip top. We're gonna to hit the home button again. So that's just a quick little video showing you guys this background apps and process list. In this video, I'm also gonna to touch on how to power off your Fire Stick. So guys, there's no real way to power off your Fire Stick. It's always gonna send it into sleep mode. The fastest way to go into sleep mode is to click and hold your home button for a few seconds and then go over to sleep. But if you wanted to shut down your Fire Stick completely, it's really not shut off. If you've been running your Fire Stick for a few days, a few weeks, a year, the best way to power it down would be to unplug it from its power supply. Don't unplug it from the television, it's still gonna be on. You need to unplug the cord from the side of your Fire Stick. Why is there a power button on the new 4K Fire Sticks? The power button is not for your Fire Stick, it's to control your television, just like the volume button is for your television. To link this 4K Fire Stick remote to the television, the first thing we're gonna need to do is go into our settings, go down and over to equipment control, select on it, Hit manage equipment, go down to your TV, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna hit change TV. You're gonna hit change TV again, and give it a second. It's gonna ask you what brand of television you have. I have a Vizio that I'm using right now. It says press the power button on your Fire TV remote to turn off your TV. Wait 10 seconds, then press the power again to turn it back on. So I'm gonna hit the power off. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna hit the power button again. So I'm gonna hit yes, because it did turn back on. Hit okay, and there we go. So now you can use your Fire TV remote to turn off your television and to turn the volume up and down on your television. So that's a pretty cool feature that they did. So I just wanted to make this one a quick video, knock a few things out at once. I told you guys how to truly shut down your Fire Stick and unplug it from the power source. I showed you how to link up your Amazon remote to your television to control your volume and to turn the television on and off. And I also gave you a quick tutorial of the background apps and process list. If you need help or service, please visit www.mydingtv.com. I hope this video helped you guys. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for all the views, all the comments. I appreciate everybody interacting with the channel, dropping comments, dropping likes. Thank you everyone, and keep your eye out for the next Ding TV video. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, leave a comment on what you think I should do a video on next. Until next time guys, peace out.